Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to use Gemini AI by Google to create free AI text to image. And right now, you might be confused because I have two browsers, left and right, on my screen right here. So I did this approach to show you real-time the difference between Gemini, or rather, Google Bard, with this one, because right now we call it Gemini. So take note, Gemini is on the right side, and this left side right here will be our reference. So this is basically DAL E3. Even though I'm using Bing right here, it is powered by DAL E3. So here's another tip for you. Additional information for you if you don't have an account yet on DAL E3, you can simply use Bing for free. They ran out, I think they replenish every month, 400 coins, so use it from here. Anyway, because if you use DAL E3 website, let me just go to it right now. On the right side, this is basically the landing page of Dolly 3 So take note, there is no free trial on this option. As you can see, I have zero credits, even though I haven't created anything here. The one below here are free templates from other creators. So that's going to be my tip for you. If you want to try the Dolly 3 powerful AI image generator, just use Bing. It's going to be bing.com slash create. Now let's move on to the trial. So again, take note, right side is Gemini, left side is going to be Dolly 3. I'm going to use the same prompt on one of each to show you the power of one of each, okay? So for the last time I have created an image of a car, this is the result. Let's try it on this end right here. And wait for the magic to happen. So I'll get back to you once Gemini is finished generating. So welcome back. Here is going to be our result. And as you can see, the difference is that for Dolly 3, it has consistent characters. Everything is e or red, rather. Everything has a background of the same house or rather similar houses. For Gemini, it gave us random cars. This is a sports car. This is an off-road car. This is a classic car. I think this is a city car. So that is one main difference of the both AI. Gemini give you random prompts or rather random photos, even though they're good quality. If you click on that one, that is really good. However, if you go back on Dolly 3, if you click on this one, everything here is the same characters. But if you're going to ask me, Gemini is much more realistic. Because this one right here doesn't look realistic, especially that side mirror, that wiper right there, the background. It's not really um, true to life, if you're going to ask me. Not like this one. This looks like a guy just took a photo of a car in the road, right? So that will be the main difference. So please take note about that one. So next up, let's have some fun here. I want to show you this one. So create an image of Elon Musk. Same thing. I'm going to paste it here and I'm going to do it at the same time. So I want to show you the error here. For Dolly 3, it won't let us proceed because basically I think that is because it's Elon Musk. So I'm going to go back and then try this one. So create an image of Elon Musk or a guy that looks like give me a second here elon musk i'm gonna try this workaround click on enter and wait for it to finish so even though we try the workaround it's still not working same goes with gemini as you can see it cannot generate images of that let me try this one our workaround if it will work on gemini so i doubt it will work so let me just go back here and then wait for Gemini to finish trying to generate a field of musk. So I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. As you can see right there, it still cannot generate, even though we're just asking for a guy that looks like Elon Musk. That is going to be their restraint, their limit. So please take note about that one. I think they're not allowed to create some images of referring to very famous people, especially Elon Musk, right? So let's move on. I want to show you this one. Give me a second here. I'm going to type in create a photo of a cyborg with the text. Take note about this one. Tutorial. Let me just everything in uppercase. Perfect. And then I'm going to paste it also here so we can generate them at the same time. And I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. Here are results. For the Dolly 3, let me just open one here. They are four. I think I'm going to go with this one. It looks very cool and very simple. And this is going to be the one for Gemini. Again, if you're going to ask me, 
The one on the left from Dolly 3 is not really realistic. And if you can see right there, it did not got the correct text. Same goes with Dolly 3 or rather, sorry about that, Gemini. Even though it did not get the entire text right, the photo is like a frame in an office. It's much more realistic. That's one thing I noticed on the both of them. So let's try looking for one here. I think it got one on this one. It got the correct text. So to get the correct text on Gemini, I suggest keep on generating. There's that button to generate more. And again, almost forgot. If you're satisfied, simply click on that button to download in full size. And that being said, that is how you use Gemini. So again, Gemini is the one on the red browser. This one right here on the left, right side. And Dolly 3 is our reference AI on the left side. So thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.